Counting on alum Jason Duggar remains silent on social media following his wedding with Maddie Grace. The two tied the knot in a fall-themed mountain wedding in Tennessee. Members of the Duggar family have already uploaded clips and pictures from the ceremony. One of them is Jill, who took the opportunity to go on a vacation in Tennessee after attending Jason's wedding. But what caught the attention of many was a clip she shared showing the family going full gangster. Keep reading to see what happened. Jill recently took to social media to share clips from the wedding ceremony of Jason and Maddie Grace. The Counting on Alum revealed that Italian dishes were served at the reception. But many were surprised by how bland and plain the foods were. Several Redditors even think it was the most boring plate they've seen from a Duggar wedding. Aside from the food that was served, Jill also took to Instagram to share another clip of the Duggar family partying with the newlyweds. But many Counting On fans on Reddit were in disbelief after the rap song Crank That by Soulja Boy was played at the ceremony. Derek even danced to it, and he somehow nailed some of its iconic steps. This made the poster curious about how Jim Bob and Michelle reacted to the song choice. Many fans are still curious about Maddie Grace's background. Jason announced their courtship and engagement without telling who she was. Maddie Grace also wiped out her social media page and put it in private. However, she recently had an interview in which she shared stories about how she and Jason met. According to Maddie Grace, their relationship happened accidentally. Jason happened to see her profile when he was checking notifications online. She then added that Jason thought she was cute and they started talking. The Counting on Alum also revealed that his decision to court Maddie Grace was also to prove to Jana that it's not too late for her to enter a relationship. When Jason Duggar quietly married on October 3rd, 2024, he joined his older sister Jana Duggar as one of the siblings who got married that year. He got married in Tennessee, where his new bride is from. But who is Jason Duggar's wife and how long did their relationship last before they got married? Without the television shows of the former reality TV family, keep counting fans and followers of the Duggar family rely on social media to help gently introduce various relationships and stay updated on any new developments. Article continues below ad. These developments also include relationships. The Duggar family follows courting rules when it comes to romantic relationships. That is, they date with the intention of eventually getting married, rather than with the idea of dating multiple people before finding the one. Jason was no different, but his courtship and what fans saw on social media before the wedding paints a picture of a brief relationship and courtship before the couple said I do. Article continues below ad. Jason married his now wife Maddie Grace on October 3rd, but had previously shared photos of her on Instagram. And they shared people that they met on the social media platform when Jason found her profile after urging Jana to find a man on social media because, in his opinion, he wanted to prove to his older sister how easy it would be to find a partner if she makes an effort. And according to the bride and groom, it really was that easy. However, Maddie's account only has a few photos and it looks like she changed her account after marrying the Duggar son. And while they slid into each other's DMs because they thought the other was cute, they also told each other about it people that their faith helped bring them together and that in many ways it was a god thing. While Maddie may be a mystery to some Duggars fans, from the couple's Instagram posts to their wedding, it looks like she'll fit in well with Jason's many siblings. Article continues below ad. Maddie and Jason met in December 2023. In May 2024, they began dating more seriously. They got engaged in August 2024. On August 24th, Jace asked me to marry him, and I couldn't be more excited. Maddie further shared Instagram on August 30th. She also added a hashtag that made it seem like they had a wedding date planned for 2025. However, she responded to a comment saying she only put that hashtag there to give herself and Jason some privacy as they prepared for their wedding, which happened much earlier than some fans expected. And the idea of a Duggar getting engaged and not getting married until next year is unheard of anyway. If there's one thing you can count on with a Duggar, the youngest Duggar kids are practically adults. That's how it feels to older sister Jinger Voilo Ne Duggar, who shared a rare photo with younger siblings Johanna Duggar and Jennifer Duggar and marveled at how fast they're growing up. The 19 kids and counting alum, 30, took to her Instagram stories for a Q&A on Monday, October 7th.
One fan asked if Jinger, who moved to California with husband Jeremy Voilo in 2019, still got to see her sisters often, as the rest of the Duggar daughters still live in Arkansas. We've been able to see them a lot recently with weddings and all, the Becoming Free Indeed author wrote, sharing a photo of herself, Johanna, 18, and Jennifer, 17, at a recent wedding. The teens looked unrecognizable as they stood on either side of their older sister, with Jennifer wearing a sage-colored gown and Johanna rocking a plum-hued dress. I always cherish the moments when we are together. And they are all growing up way too fast often that the younger Duggar siblings Jackson, Johanna, Jennifer, Jordan Grace, and Josie make appearances on social media. However, with both older sister Jana Duggar and older brother Jason Duggar getting married in recent weeks, their faces have popped up in rare moments online. Josie, 14, looked all grown up in a video captured at Jana's wedding to Stephen Wisman on August 15. The teen wore a neutral colored dress with puffy sleeves and could be seen patting her new brother-in-law on the back as he and Jana, 34, entered the room. Jinger revealed during the September 4th episode of her and Jeremy's self-titled podcast that Jana, Mom Michelle Duggar, and some of their other sisters visited California to celebrate the eldest Duggar daughter's bachelorette party before her big day. Moving away from most of her family, Jinger has remained close with many of her siblings, especially sister Joanna Forsyth, nay Duggar. Joanna, 26, and husband Austin Forsyth have made annual visits with their kids to California and her older sister has urged her to move to the West Coast herself. Joy and Austin brought their kids to town for a visit, and it has us wishing they'd just moved to LA so we could adventure for good. Jingo captioned a YouTube video in January. Joanna responded in her own vlog days later. This is the first trip, not that we're ever gonna move there probably, but this is the first time where I was like, I mean, I could see us living here if that's where God moved us, she said. It was so good to be with her and just have some quality time and catch up on life but I don't know if we would ever. Counting on fans are never quite sure where Jill Duggar Dillard and her husband Derek Dillard stand with their family, so TLC fans wondered if they attended Jason Duggar's recent wedding. Well, you can read on to find out. In her book, Counting the Cost, TLC fans saw that Michelle and Jim Bob's daughter didn't hold back. Additionally, she also appeared in the docuseries Shiny Happy People, Duggar Family Secrets. So, being around the family might be a bit awkward. Nevertheless, she was at Jana Duggar's wedding, but not included in the wedding party. Jill Duggar's younger brother, Jason Duggar, married Maddie Grace a day or so ago, and the wedding party for the bride consisted of Johanna Duggar, Jennifer Duggar, Jordan Duggar, and Josie Duggar. But it's not clear who is Maddie's matron of honor. Ahead of the wedding, Derek Dillard's wife took to her Instagram and shared that they put Fenna the pup into a boarding place as they were ready to do a road trip. However, she didn't say where they were going. Well, in an update, it turns out that they were on their way to Jason Duggar's wedding in Tennessee. Jill Duggar shared part two of their road trip, and they stopped over in Knoxville, Tennessee, as well as passing through Franklin. On the way, they were sad to see some of the damage from Hurricane Helene. In her caption, the Counting on Alum used her hashtags to let TLC fans know she went to the wedding. She said, Once they arrived at the venue, which the TLC Alum said was beautiful, they attended the wedding rehearsal. Taking to the comment section, her Counting on fans had something to say. I am so glad that y'all had an amazing time at Jason and Maddie Grace's wedding on Thursday. Looks like y'all had a lot sick of fun. What a great trip. Congratulations, Maddie and Jason. Franklin, Tennessee is a beautiful place. You are in my neck of the woods, Knoxville. If you guys need anything, anything at all, don't hesitate to ask. And that venue I ask gorgeous. Congratulations to the newlyweds. Beautiful thank you for sharing. Jill Duggar is offering a behind the scenes look into brother Jason Duggar's wedding to Maddie Grace in Tennessee. In an Instagram post chronicling the Thursday, October 3rd, nuptials, Jill, 33, documented her morning with husband Derek and their children, Israel David, 9, Samuel Scott, 7, and Frederick Freddie Michael, 2. The family kicked off the day by heading to an indoor swimming pool, where Derek, 35, guided Freddie around. The couple then returned to their room to get ready, with Jill curling her hair and changing into a white top and pink-colored pants. We're leaving the hotel, heading to the wedding, 
Jill said in a clip of her and Derek walking down the hallway. The video cut to the family driving to the ceremony held at the estate at Sweetwater Creek in Newport, Tennessee. Ahead of the wedding, Jill shared a series of images of her and Derek cozying up together. She sent the photos to the Dixie Cups track Chapel of Love. While waiting for Maddie to walk down the aisle, Jill shared a glimpse of the wedding party waiting at the altar as the guests sat in white chairs facing the mountain range. People previously reported that brothers Jedediah, James, Justin, and Jackson all were groomsmen while Maddie enlisted Johanna, Jennifer, Jordan, and Josie as bridesmaids. Maddie then walked down the aisle to sleeping at last song turning page. After Jason, 24, and Maddie exchanged vows, there was a unity cord braiding which symbolizes the union of God, bride and groom, and the duo sealed their nuptials with a kiss. The duo walked down the aisle as the crowd erupted into cheers. Next came the reception, which included white and gold plates and cutlery on each of the tables. Jill shared a close-up image of her pasta dish before unveiling the couple's chosen dessert. As Jason and Maddie walked into the reception hand in hand, they were met with applause and proceeded to cut the cake. Derek, for his part, dug into ice cream, telling Jill in a video that he was eating a butter pecan-flavored scoop. Jason and Maddie were also seen ordering their own ice cream and cobbler from a food truck on premises. The night continued with Maddie's bouquet toss, which was set to Beyonce's single ladies put a ring on it. Maddie and Jason then embraced while slowly dancing as guests held sparklers in a circle around the couple. Afterward, the dance floor was open up to everyone, but Derek opted for the grass to show off his moves to Soldier Boy's crank that the night came to an end with Maddie and Jason exiting the venue while their guests held up sparklers as they made their way to their car. Maddie and Jason got engaged after he popped the question on a beach. On August 24th, Jace asked me to marry him, and I could not be more excited. Maddie wrote via Instagram in August, sharing photos of the proposal. Jason and Maddie publicly debuted their courtship in May. Jill Duggar is giving fans the inside scoop on brother Jason Duggar's nuptials. The 33-year-old reality TV personality shared an Instagram video on Sunday, October 6th, that documented her family's road trip to attend Jason's wedding to girlfriend Maddie Grace. Road trip to TNPT3 Jason and Maddie's wedding, she captioned the video that showed the family having some pool time, getting ready for the wedding, and a breakdown of the actual ceremony. Jill traveled from Salome Springs, Arkansas with her husband Derek Dillard, 35, and their children Israel David, 9, Samuel Scott, 7, and Frederick Freddie Michael, 2 to the estate at Sweetwater Creek in Newport, Tennessee, where around 300 guests gathered to celebrate the newlyweds. Jason and Maddie tied the knot on October 3rd, in a ceremony that featured Jill's brother Jedediah Duggar, 25, acting as best man. In the video, Jill could be seen getting ready as the Dixie Cup's song Chapel of Love played over top. After eating some Wendy's, doing her makeup, and putting on a white blouse and light pink pants, the Counting the Cost author shared footage of the ceremony. She showed Maddie walking down the aisle toward a large, wooden cross adorned with white flowers, while someone helped to lay out her long, lace veil. Jill also shared brief clips of the vows, a unity cord braiding ceremony, the kiss, and the introduction of Maddie and Jason as a married couple. Jill shared pictures from the reception, like of the play settings, the Italian food the couple had available as a nod to their honeymoon to Italy the couple's grand entrance, and the cake cutting. The happy couple opted for a cheesecake, which was on display in front of a faux grass backdrop and a neon sign that read, happily ever after. Her husband, Derek, could be seen enjoying some butter pecan ice cream as the newlyweds had